My friend stood at the window behind his daughter, looking out at the emptiness. Trucks outside hospitals, blocks of ice, tents set up in parks, as if they'd been there since the Civil War. Where did everyone go? My daughter asks. This is the world without us, comes the answer. This is what inside looks like. People, at first, were made of clay, like little gray dolls. The only trees were the apples we were forbidden to eat. We would have done anything just to have someone to talk to. But it all went away so quickly. It was carried past us as if the whole thing had been a play or a traveling circus. The first job I had was heating water, operating these massive fluid heaters on well sites. And so we would drive these huge semi trucks uh, with a big 7,000 liter diesel tank and a massive furnace on the back. And we would hook up uh, these hoses to these massive tanks of water. And we'd circulate the water through the furnace and then basically just ignite the diesel on nozzles and just blast flame through the furnace or the boiler to heat up uh, the water. All of these trucks are running nonstop, 24-7, idling until they're being used. All the generators that are giving us light all run on diesel. Everything is running on diesel in this huge site, hundreds of dudes on top of a mountain. And it just blew my mind to a fathom and imagine the amount of diesel being burnt every hour, this finite resource, just to extract natural gas, this other finite resource. stalactites and stalagmites, all designed by Gaudi. Mushroom forms, elaborate mosaics, shapes of tree roots, branches, vines,